This is Samsung's response to the iPhone 16 series. They have finally taken what could be their biggest decision of 2024. As Apple is busy handling their latest lawsuit with the US State of Department as well as working on the iPhone 16 series for September of this year, Samsung on the other hand is preparing a new dark horse product that nobody expected and it could be a huge surprise for Apple. Before the launch of the iPhone 16 series, Samsung will be introducing their new new Z Flip 6 and the Fold 6 as expected, but now there's a new product coming after the iPhone 16 launch towards the end of that peak iPhone month of September, and that, ladies and gentlemen, could be the brand new fan edition Galaxy Z Fold 6. This will be the most affordable folding phone from Samsung ever in history, with latest rumors pointing towards a crazy $800 price, making it about $1,000 cheaper than the Galaxy Z Fold 6 again absolutely bonkers. A lot of people have been asking for this for quite some time and seems like Samsung is finally delivering the promise. Although currently we don't have any specs info regarding this surprise 4.6 fan edition, but regardless of its affordable price, it is expected to pack some serious flagship level specs. So check this out, this brand new Fold, a new improved Z Flip 6 and the already established Galaxy S24 series all sitting around $1000 price mark. This Lahina will provide a very tough challenge for the iPhone 16 series. Now that's not it. Samsung is also making a major statement against Apple once and for all. We're gonna talk about it right after this. Cold turkey may be great on sandwiches, but there's a better way to break your habits. And no, we're not talking about some wisdom from a traveler who thinks the best way to beat jet lag is to fly in the opposite direction. We're talking about our sponsor Fume, and they'll look at the problem in a different way. Not everything in a bad habit is wrong. So instead of a drastic, uncomfortable change, why not just remove the bad from your habit? Fume is an innovative, award-winning flavored air device that does just that. Instead of electronics, fume is completely natural. Instead of vapor, fume uses flavored air. And instead of harmful chemical, fume uses all natural, delicious flavors. You get it. Instead of bad, fume is good. Fume comes with an adjustable airflow dial as well as movable parts and magnets for fidgeting, giving your fingers a lot to do which is helpful for de-stressing while breaking your habit. They also offer a base which is a weighted stand where you can rest your fume when not in use. Not gonna lie, I was genuinely surprised when I first tried it because of the awesome flavors. They feel really nice and fresh, plus I do fancy the design. So what are you waiting for? Click the link in the description and head over to tryfume.com slash ztechcare and use the special discount code for 10% off or you can also scan the QR code that is visible on the screen. Alrighty, now in case you don't know, the iPhone 16 and the 16 Plus will be the only devices in the world to be released in 2024 with a 60 hertz display, which is absolutely heartbreaking to see on a phone in 2024 that cost $800. On the other hand, Samsung is about to make the biggest statement by completely ending the 60 hertz display journey of Samsung flagship phones. We already have 120 hertz on pretty much all Samsung flagship phones except one, which was the Galaxy Z Flip. In case you don't know, the outer display on the Flip 5 had a 60Hz display, but now according to the latest rumors, Flip 6 is finally set to come with a 120Hz refresh rate with this outer display that will provide super smooth operation. With this move, Samsung pretty much kills the 60Hz display. Along with this, the Flip 6 is also rumored to finally pack a proper pro level 50 megapixel sensor similar to the S24 series, as well as the longest battery on a Samsung Flip phone thanks to a rumor. 4000 lane per cell. Flip 6 is going to be another dangerous rival to the iPhone 16 series along with the affordable Fold, pretty much solidifying Samsung's major plan to counter the hype of the iPhone 16 series. Let me know what you think about Samsung's game plan in the comment section below. Do you think Samsung made the right call to make a affordable folding phone? Let me know in the comments. With that being said, I'll see you guys later. Peace out.